Hello everyone, my name is Tony, I go by Rainbadood on the internet, and we are back today with another episode of Dragon Age Origins, picking up exactly where we left off with Zaprian, blech, with Zathrian, uh, having sacrificed himself to end the curse, end his vengeance against the humans of the forest here. Now is better um, than later. I don't think there's anything else here that I wanted to pick up. No. Uh, but now we go back to the elves. We've done everything here in the woods, I believe. Give the scarf back. Give the iron burke. Go back to them. Uh, defeated the dark spawn in that area. Conscripts dispatched. Okay. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. I need lyrium. I am low. And I think I need some more concentrator agent so that I can make healing potions if I run out. But I think we're good for a while. I'm not gonna say for the rest of the game because I know how quickly I can run out of these. If I had enough tactics, I'd probably make more again and win. Use health. Yeah, use health potions. But I don't think we've upgraded the tactics slots enough for that. Oh wait, there might be a secret thing here. I'll get on. And there's dudes. Can I get through the ladder? Oh, you can get off my back. I don't get through anything here. Nope. Oh, but there's things over there. Oh, we got our hands dirty. Again, they all go. Yeah. Not oh, funny. And as an adult, I must have done a full time. Never seen this. You know what I didn't do between recordings like I said I would? I didn't come back through here and loot. So you guys are probably gonna see me if I can get another part Can I get you a ladder? So you can get off my back? What if I just want to exit the forest, dog? Can I go from camp to... Me? Ooh, I can sell stuff while I'm here. You and your friends are formidable folk, indeed. Let me see I'm wares, please. Uh, yes, I can. Sell all of this garbage. Do I want so Fallon didn't reach. Um, these are basically the same. I think I'll sell this one. Uh, let's see. That's fine. Let's sell that. Sell the scale boots. I want to sell the ancient elven armor because I think that's unique. I don't like selling the dog stuff even though I'm never going to switch the dog stuff out because I just think it's too good. Um, I think I can give these to the people over there. Actually, I might. I think I can give gems to somebody over here. Is it the dwarves? Yep, gems for the dwarves. Give all Malachites. Give all Topazes. And what everything does brings us closer is to it victory. It increases the number of um, reinforcements you get during the final battle with the Archdemon. You and your friends are formidable folk, indeed. Uh, I don't remember exactly what the like maximum limiters are for it, but it's worth doing. I'll sell all this stuff. I don't know what the manuscript copy is for. Uh, let's sell all these werewolf pelts. Let's sell all these wolf pelts. Um, we have another backpack thing. You do. Cool. I didn't even use this. Like I said, I would. 
I'm just gonna sell it. Because I don't remember using these ever. Uh, let's see. I'm not gonna do the big gifts because that makes it too easy. Uh, Tome of Physical Technique. Warrior or Rogue. I don't think I need that right now. Uh, let's see here. Do I have Distillation Agent? I don't. And I don't have any flasks. Oop. Just give me a bunch of flasks. And give me... Give me a bunch of Distillation Agent too, if I can afford it. Yep. I might even buy another batch. Yeah. As long as I stay around the 100 stopper mark, I think I'm going to be okay. Um, and then I will also later need to go to... Uh, buh, 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 buh. The Mage's Tower to buy more Lyrium. But for now... Uh, Indeed. Liliana... Yes. Yes. There. I'm gonna go back to these ruins, and if I can remember to cut these out. Something on your mind? Nope. Thank you. Let's level you up. Uh, constitution. Um. Let's do that. And then top tier weapon talents. I thought I already gave you. No, I gave you suppressing fire. Now you get scatter shot. Okay. Um, what does scatter shot do? When in this mode. Nope, that's not it. Boop. Uh, fires a single arrow that automatically hits, stuns the targets, deals normal damage shatters hitting all nearby enemies with the same effect. Ah, uh, that's really good. So... What does distraction do? Um... Deals normal damage if it hits, imposes a normal penalty to target. I'm going to get rid of Crippling Shot. I'm going to put Enemy Clustered with at least three allies. Uh, use... What's on a mode? Can't I, I clear enemy? Why can't I use ability on that? Attacking party member. Probably me, just because I'm going to be in the thick of things a lot. Use ability. Scatter shot. There we go. Okay. Uh, if I can remember. Then I'll cut this out, because there's probably not going to be anything interesting here. Um, but, until then, you're, you're stuck with me. Looting. I've always, I think there is a Dragon Age um, tabletop, and I would love to play it. Um, Fun fact for you, uh, Thetis, uh, the name of the setting here, uh, its name comes from, it's actually an acronym, it's THE Dragon Age setting. Um, and I just thought that was fun when I learned that. Um, and it, in, it inspired a piece of world building um, for my homebrew D&D world, which I, I, I think I'm coming to terms with that I'm never going to finish it. Um, As and I probably like. should just play it <laughs> with people. Um, so in my homebrew D&D world, 
Um, there was, of course, this huge uh, event that happened that everyone calls Impact, and it's because um, people saw what they believed to be the fist of the Goddess of Judgment uh, slamming into the Earth. And it was a, it was in fact a comet, but it was also sent by the Goddess of Judgment um, to a single continent island um, in the southern hemisphere. Uh, it was sent there because the population of rock gnomes that uh, lived there were doing uh, abominable experiments on things. They ended up creating mind flares, um, and the Goddess of Judgment was like, that's a problem, and destroyed it with a, um, with a comet. And so, the name of the area is Lost History. Drop I don't right think ahead. I know it. Drop right ahead. Um, Drop right ahead. Or at least I they haven't come up with it yet. And... Uh, what I've named that like series of islands now, um, because it was a continent and it shattered into. I'm doing hand stuff and you guys can't see it. Um, On my way. It's now called the Broken Isles of Salea. Because uh, Salea is the goddess of Drop right ahead. Um, and that's short for like Bios, right? And so the idea that I have for this game, I haven't really fleshed this part out very much. Um, I think I want it to be a computer simulation. And what I think I want um, is I want this to be a simulation run by the Goddess of Judgment. Like, if she does this, if she sends this comet, what happens to the world? And using that data, um, I think it, it can be twofold. Either she's using the data yes, to determine whether course. or not it's worth it, or... Um, she's doing it because the comet is on its way. She didn't actually send it. She's running the simulation to find out can the comet be stopped or is it worth stopping? Um, the end, what's the end goal for this? Um, I think the end goal would be like if she can't stop it, does the world continue on and is it a world worth like living in? Because if it is, then maybe she just doesn't stop it. Uh, but if it isn't, if things can't be stopped, and if the comet can't be, if the comet could be stopped, and uh, and the world is just an awful place to be, if it does, if she doesn't intervene, then maybe she does. Um, and so I imagine that like she's in her celestial courtroom the simulation's running, people are arguing their case in front of her, um, and so the plot of the game that I have planned, I have kind of like a strong beginning and a strong end, but I don't really have all the stuff in the middle, and that's kind of what I'm anxious about. Um, so the beginning, I think, um, So after impact happens in this simulation, the areas that aren't completely destroyed, the remaining kingdoms, villages, etc., they all kind of enter this um, period of isolation. So the beginning of the game that I plan is going to start out in this country. Um, it's about the size of modern day France. Um, and you'll be in this little village called Aranth. Um, and a young white dragon is going to attack. And that's important because the village was previously Drop attacked right ahead. by Drop right ahead. an adult Drop right ahead. white dragon. But it's been so long that most people don't actually remember the size of the dragon. So when it comes back, people are going to be like, oh my god, that's the dragon that attacked us all those years ago. It's small because dragons take forever to age, but it's the same dragon. It's not. Um, the ancient white dragon, or the adult white dragon, will way. actually have layered in, Drop, in the right bottom ahead. of a nearby lake. Um, but it was slain by 
mind flares. Trap which up until right this ahead. point in history have never been seen before. And so the young white dragon, having hatched and been forced out of its lair, is now looking Trap for a new right place ahead. to lair. Trap um, right ahead. Once the party I survives shall. that fight, or that encounter, it's not going to be a fight. Like, level 1 to level 3 adventures, right they're away. not going to survive a fight against a young white dragon. Um, once they survive that, then it's like, alright, well now we have to go find out what's going on. So they'll go out into the forest, there'll be like a bunch of little hit, a bunch of little hints like cranium rats in the, uh, in the basement of the inn. Um, I plan on having like cranium wolves, glass phylactery. Oh, it's a revenant. Um, ah! Cranium wolves in, uh... <laughs> Calling trouble for going to fall. Ah, sure won't be. And there'll be a cave that they like come from. In the party does a good job. There's going to be a um, an illusion at the back of the cave. That's a, it's the wall of the cave. Um, but uh, uh. They go they'll find a laboratory, right? Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm getting destroyed. Later. Oh, oh, no, you don't. Uh, when you were in peril. Oh, let go. And also, I need your group heal. Do I need to activate this? All right, all right. Oh my gosh. I'll get on it. You talk. You guys are doing massive damage to me. Lost our hands. Don't die already! I never like this part. And I'm not doing Here comes trouble! Let's see some blood! Aura of weakness. Penalty to attack and defense. Possible movement speed. That is unfortunate. Ah. Some defense, please. Thank you. talking about my game, but then the Revenant happened. I have a paper. Is it a scroll of Bannister? Black Vials. I'm not gonna read that right now. Um. Oh, the illusion. Yeah, there's gonna be a, a laboratory there that's run by a Mind Flayer, but the Mind Flayer's not there right now. And it's not gonna identify it as a Mind Flayer. Um, but... It'll just talk all about right, like, all experiments right. on the local wildlife. It'll be very, it'll be in like a very technical tongue. Um, and Allow the party me. will do like various I could tasks do that for, you. for the villagers, like um, some violent fungus has taken root in one of the nearby groves where. Uh, the woodmaker gets this very fancy wood that he uh, exports to other villages that the village is actually very famous for. Um, all right, all right. There's a nearby temple to the goddess of the wilds that will be like under siege. I have a whole plot Tell line me. with doppelgangers and the um, and the tax collector. Adventure journal. Um, and like once they come back from either having rescued the tax collector or failing um, the village council will be like alright go kill the white dragon 
and they'll kill the young white dragon. Um, but that's when the adult white dragon will make itself known. I think I'm satisfied with it being an adult. Um, because I think it's like a thousand, uh, it's like a hundred to a thousand years for an adult white dragon, I think. Um. <laughs> uh, hey, you can't deal with this on your own. Go to the other villages, go to the capital, um, and assemble forces. And, like, in the process of you doing this, not only will you come back with reinforcements, but you yourselves will also be strong enough to take on the dragon. Um. And I'll have like two or three different, like, you can go directly here, but anything else is kind of just open sandbox. Um, and when they actually get to the capital and they ingratiate themselves with the king or the king's council, um, a, uh, a mind witness will appear as they're either talking with the king or when the king's out and they'll have to save the king from being assassinated by this mind witness um, they will be requested to like investigate what that is where it came from what sent it Trap right ahead um, and it will be one of the king's advisors um, that has actually been replaced with a mind flare it's done. Um, and that mind flare is not the same one as the one in the laboratory in the forest, um, but this one will have more explicit details on where it came from. And where they've come from is across the world. So on the opposite side of the globe where the comet impacts, um, that is going to be how the mind players have escaped into the underground. There, there will have been a crevice created um, where the mind players like basically tunnel through the earth, and they end up on the other side of the world where there are, or where there was a lot of dwarven kingdoms. And now there's this one last bastion um, on that continent that's basically like a three-tiered fortress that's built into the cliffside um, of the continent. And for that citadel, it is a never-ending deluge of assault um, from the Mind Flayers and their creation. So the Mind Flayers have created Drow, Dwergar, Sverf Neblin um, from the various species uh, that they've come across. And mm -hmm. they enslave them uh, through creation. And uh, have also cavorted with demons and figured out like the process for pulling them from the abyss, and that's how they're making this assault happen. Is this all new? Have I ever been here? I don't think I usually come back in these playthroughs for this. Um, it's done. And but that is where the the elder brain uh, will be, and so the party will have to navigate uh, sailing around the world uh, to prevent the elder brain. Um, the mind player in the capital is going to have details about the elder brain's plans. Whether they can I get um, you a ladder Allow me. so you can get off my back or. Me. Uh, find documents in his home, for example. So, uh, the Elder Brain's like big plan is like it's going to build up its forces here, and when all right, all right, when it's ready, when that citadel of dwarves falls, um, it is going to teleport the entire collective of um, mind flayers and the newly created things that they make out of those dwarves um, to the kingdom that the party is from 
It's going to teleport it right over uh, the capital. Wipe everything out there. And then start to expand in that country and on that continent. Um, and so what I kind of plan is for like the party to do that navigation. Um, go across the sea. Maybe get sidetracked by a few things. Fight through the citadel with the dwarves. And maybe get a contingent to go with them. Deeper into... Um, I think I call it the crevasse. Or the rift or something like that. Um, and try to take out the Elder Brain. And if they don't get there on time, or if they fail, then of course it is going to teleport everything over there, but they'll be caught up in the teleport so that they end up going back to um, where they need to be. And that'll be like the big showdown. Either uh, in the rift or above uh, the capital. We've been waiting for you, Warden. Oh, hey, it's you. I've been waiting for you, Warden. Um, so that's kind of the gist of it. And I have a couple of the cities, like, very thoroughly documented. But I don't have like, a lot of the minor quest-type details filled out. Um, I don't think there's any mages here in this fight, so I think I might just crush them. All right, all right. This gives me time. Oh. Alright! Oh. That's right, come on! Oh, you did do that, so that's nice. Uh. Uh. On your guard, Rich! Just call it a reaper! Uh, so oh. 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 I think I have like the 1 to 5 stuff planned out, but obviously like if you're going to travel around the world and fight out the brain, you probably want to be like 12 to 15 I'll get on it. Uh, when I'm in danger. Oh my gosh. you more likely. Oh, I do need more dexterity. That's what it is. I need dexterity in order to be more likely to hit. Good to know. I'm going to level up next. Got oh gosh, it. I'm hitting every button but the one I want to hit. Alright, alright. It is done. The essence of the wolf's heart has banished all traces of cursed blood from the hunters. It is too bad that Zathrian you know had, had to die. I, ah, I, see. I felt it when he departed. I think he was ready to go. Um, I'm not going to call him a hero because it was kind of fucked up what he did. Did you know about his connection to the curse? I suspected. But Zathrian did not like to talk about that. Nonetheless, the curse is over and no one else will be subjected to it. It will be difficult to fill Zathrian's shoes. He was our keeper for many centuries, and he will be sorely missed. But I am keeper now. Let me say it officially then. 
I hereby swear to uphold the terms of the ancient contract our people formed with the Grey Wardens. Call and we shall come, with great speed and purpose, and we shall strike at your foes. This I swear. Uh, thank you. It has been a long time since the Dalish marched to war, but I trust that in the end, we shall make a difference for you. I hope so too. Can I have what's in the chest? Songbook. Hmm. Uh, a thras. So the hunters were cured, but not in time for my Denyla. I found Denyla. She gave me this. By the creators. Denyla's scarf. Zathrian said she was killed by the same curse plaguing the others. Where is she now? She's dead. That's all you need to know. So, the Keeper did not lie? The curse killed her? You are certain of this? I mean, technically, I, I did. If you must know, she was a werewolf. So I was right. But what became of her? She died, but not before she sent your love. She told you that's that? She, yeah, that's what she told me. Yes. I don't, I don't like this, but that is how it happened. Here. I don't want to be out of this interaction. <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't, I have to make me very uncomfortable. Uh, plus four spell resistance. Uh, Dagan. Hello. Greetings to you, friend. I understand I have you to thank for my rescue from the forest. I was glad to I don't want your efforts to go unrewarded. Here is a gem I traded for when I was amongst the outsiders. I thought to make a necklace out of it for my bride, but I want you to have it. I know it is of worth. Uh, thank you, it's most kind. Then take it with the blessings of the gods, I hope. And now, I am afraid I must rest. The Keeper says I am not yet fully recovered, after all. I wish you well, my friend. Uh, was it really just a gem? Yes, probably. Oh, I didn't finish giving out gifts. Uh, and then we have to go to Barathorn. Yes, he will have... We are working hard to make enough equipment for all of the hunters. Our armaments will be superior to anything else you find on the battlefield. I have some ironbark for you. Truly? Let me see. Yes. That is indeed iron bark, and a substantial quantity of it as well. Well done. An agreement is an agreement, and I will craft something from this wood for you. What would you like? A bow? Or perhaps a breastplate? Um... I think both are more appropriate. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna be a dick. Um... I like bows, why not? Manuvinin, I will craft it myself. Watch if you prefer. It will not take long. What kind of bow was it? Uh, ba -ba -ba. Wolf killer. Plus four against undead, plus eight versus beasts. I'll probably keep it just because it we is... We are working hard to make enough equipment for all of the hunters. I wish you could have made a staff. That would have been more useful. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Ba -ba. Inventory management. I'd rather just buy lyrium from the circle, though. Uh, did anyone else get level ups? Horse flowers. Blast it. Blood and damnation. Uh, Indeed. Yes. Yes, everyone did. Cool. Uh, now that I know that dexterity is your plus to hit, <laughs> I need to increase people's plus to hit. Uh, that final blow in there. Morrigan. 
Uh, yeah, you desperately need some constitution because you died a bunch when we were playing. We almost have you fully into entropy. Which I kind of want your shapeshifter stuff too. I like using those, but we'll keep we'll keep doing the entropy stuff. Sten, you hey boy. I swear to god, I already got two-handed sweep. Did I, did I do something different? Uh, let's see, who else? Blast and damnation! Thunder, Humper! Yes. Yes. Uh, Vashadan! Yes. because that's a very low constitution. Uh, uh, I could give you Feast of the Solemn. Oh, I made you a duelist, didn't I? Level up. Pigeon Clock. Horse feathers. Um. I think next on my list was Denerim. Yes. Indeed. Yes. Uh, what all do we have left? We gotta go back to Arl Eamon, but first we have to do the Urn of Secret Ashes. Is some stuff in Denerim to do. Say the Cabal of Malefic Harm. Maleficarum are in the same place where those two ogres were. So let's do that while we're here. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? I'll get on it. Win. Yes, Alistair? My shirt has a hole in it. Oh. I see. And? Can you mend it when we get back to camp? Can't you mend your own clothes? Why do I have to do it? Sometimes I pick up too much fabric and it ends up all puckered and the entire garment hangs wrong afterwards. And you're, you know, grandmotherly. Grandmothers do that sort of thing, don't they? Darning socks and whatnot. You don't want me to have to fight Darkspawn in a shirt with a <laughs> hole, <laughs> do you? It might get bigger. I might catch cold. Oh, all right. I'll mend your shirt the next time we set up camp. Oh, and while you're at it, the elbows kind of need patching, too. Careful, young man. Or puckered garments may be the least of your problems. Um... It is outside the ruins, isn't it? Very slow loading here. I haven't seen this in a little bit of a trap. You're awake. Did you? Why did that happen outside? Did you feel it too? It was like the archdemon saw us. Saw us! What does that mean? I think. Wait. Did you hear that? This is gonna be interesting because I don't actually get to control everybody. Die already! Uh, <laughs> Got it. 
I guess it's like Duncan once said. We can sense them, and they can sense us. We'd best be more careful from now on. This camp isn't safe any longer. Yep. Fortification should be built around the camp. Moving on with what I want to do. I don't, I don't, uh... Yes. Yes. Indeed. I don't want to do all the camp chatter just yet. I don't like how slow it is. Like this has always been slow. I think it's faster than I remember it being on the Xbox 360. Though. So that's that's useful. Oh, there's dark spawn here. Hello, dark spawn. Let us end this. <laughs> Doing the fade thing. Watch out! <laughs> <laughs> I'll get on it. it can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Tell me. You see, it's been a while. And then we'll go deal with those malefic harm. I think there's a, isn't there a spell, it's either a healing spell or one of like the spirit healer spells that can cure injuries. I don't think I have it though. I know I don't have it, but I don't know if, uh, I don't know how long it'll take for us to learn it. You're still here. I think I have books that I can give you to... Oh, you've done it now. You've surely done it now. <laughs> oh, you've done it now. You've surely done it now. <laughs> I was hoping I could give him one of the books that I found. And, uh, hello, Maleficars. You are not welcome here. I'm um, here on behalf of the Mages Collective. Doing the Templars dirty work for them, eh? Templars or Mages, it means nothing to us. There is dark power here, and you won't stand in our way. I think my Templar friend has uh, a disagreement with that. Ready. Uh, there's one back there. I'll get on it. 
Get on it. Spells do spear damage. Uh, da, 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 da. That's it for that. So I think now. Oh, but I can't travel from here. That's annoying. So now I'm gonna go back to the Mage's Tower. I'm gonna buy a bunch of Lyrium so that I can make a bunch of potions. And then, and then, and then... Um, on to Denerim. We'll do, like, the baseline stuff in Denerim. And then we'll go do Urn of Sacred Ashes next. You! You were the Grey Warden who broke the curse! I demand to know what happened to the werewolves. Where did they go? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you. Uh, they're no longer werewolves. The curse was broken. That makes no difference. Those, those monsters killed my husband. They killed so many of my people. They have Dalish blood on their hands. If they are human once more, that shall make it all the easier to take vengeance for their crimes. Tell me where they are. Zathryn wanted a vengeance too. Look what it did. It destroyed him. Yes. I. Perhaps you speak wisely. If they are gone and never return here, then. Perhaps it is better to let it simply end there. We will go back to the camp then. Thank you for your words. Which way is my hair going today? Please accept this small token of my gratitude. It belonged to my husband. And I. Cannot carry it any longer. I just want to leave. Get me out of this forest. I've had enough. How do I get out of here? Why am I here? Of all places. Why are you saving here? What happened? There's enemies there. Do I want to fight them? I mean, I am close to leveling up again. I guess. Ah! A bear. A great bear. Let us end this. Watch in horror as I rip you apart! You have no skill, only desperation! I'll get on it. I feel like I have to save when I load into any any new area. Speak. 
because I don't want it to crash. And then have lost a bunch of progress. Um, can I just leave through this way? That'd be great. Nope. It just is going to take me to that next area. That's annoying. this way yes okay so we're going to go back to the circle tower gonna get some lyrium make our way to denerim do stuff in denerim also i need to stop by camp give zevran those gloves that we found because those are very important to him Uh, hello, you really killed all those abominations. Yes, I'm sure you need supplies off. after that. Um, boop. Do you not have lyrium? Oh, there it is. Yep, just give me a bunch of that stuff, please. Do I have? I have distillation agent. I don't really have any concentrator though. So I'll buy some of that. Uh, injury kit recipe, do I already have? I got lesser, but I don't have the regular one. You really killed him. I'm sure you need supplies. Yes, up. yes, yes. Ba, ba, ba. Do you have anything else that I want? This is a gift for shale. Um. I don't know what my standing with Shale is right now. <sighs> Andrew's blessing. Plus two to all attributes is kinda good. Mm. Do I have stuff that I can sell that will give me that extra like five sovereigns? Probably not. I bet if I sold all these arrows, I know I can sell all the bolts for sure because I don't have anyone that uses a crossbow. Uh, and was there like a staff that I wanted from you? Staff of the Magister Lord um, is actually it's pretty good, but I think Andrew's breast. Bleh. Andrew Will's blessing. Well, the six will power in six. Blah blah blah. I think I'm probably gonna save up to try to get this staff. Um, nope, not here. So I need twenty-one more, twenty-two more sovereigns before I can come back and get that. Um, and then very important. I can only make regular. That's annoying. But I mean, it's better than nothing. So we'll make just a bunch of these. And hold on to the rest. Um, go to camp. I need to get the recipe for the greater lyrium potion. Because I don't want to... Oh, no! No! The one time I don't save in an area. Man. That's annoying. Save. And like, one crash every 45 minutes is not as bad as we were getting. Go back to camp. And then... Play the game of whose gift belongs to who. So I know for a fact that Liliana. Oh, gets how that. dear I of you! I must have already given her some. Because. Yeah. Ogren gets like a That looks cheer. fine indeed. Zivran gets. He's 
clubs, but that's going to initiate a cutscene. So let's give Shale this. Very nice. And where's Barkspawn? Barkspawn gets an Oxbone. Who gets the painted Skyball? I think it might be Alistair, but it could also be Wynn. Or Morgan. Let me give it to Morgan. Interesting. It was not Morgan. Um, well, Zevran. Gloves? You're giving me gloves? What for? Um, I thought you might like them. I did not mean to sound ungrateful. It is just... Wait, these are Dalish, are they not? My mother was Dalish and had a pair very similar to these. The leather was less thick, and it had more embroidery, but these are very close, and quite handsome. Uh, you're very welcome. Do I seem surprised? Perhaps I am. Still, I appreciate the fact that you even thought of me. No one has simply given me a gift before. Thank you. You're very welcome. Everybody approved. And I leveled up. Uh, let's do willpower two, dex two, or do willpower one, dex two. Um, I could get master herbalism, or I can start leveling up combat training. <laughs> um, uh, that's just tactic slots. Uh, I will do combat training, I think. Even though I don't think this character particularly needs it, because he doesn't have any of the, like, long wind-up spells. Yep, it is. It's cleansing aura that cures injuries. Um... I think... I think I'm gonna take Arcane Mastery just to check it off the list and also get that bonus to spell power because spell power affects my melee at this point. Um, were there any other gifts that I needed to give out? I don't think so. Uh, let's end today by doing like some chatter. Something on your mind? Uh, I had another dream about the Arcane. Yes, me too. And I got you the feeling at the end it. there Sorry, that no. it saw us, was aware of us, whatever you want to call it. Could it just be my imagination, I suppose? What do you think? Uh, I think we need to be extra careful. I thought we were already being extra careful. Does that mean we have to be extra, extra careful now? Great. There I was, enjoying my nap. I guess one thing is certain, at least, isn't it? It's official. This is a blight. Mm -hmm. uh, Something else? on your mind? Of course. Uh, I think we already asked all this stuff. Uh, Zivran. I've a question, if I may. Uh, go ahead. Well, here's the thing. I swore an oath to serve you, yes? And I understand the quest you're on, and this is all very fine and well. My question pertains to what you intend to do with me once this business is over with, as a point of curiosity. Um... Uh... Does your oath expire then? Not precisely. I said I would serve you until you saw fit to release me. One simply assumes that once your Grey Warden business is finished, you would have no need of an assassin to follow you about. Am I wrong? Uh, I could always use a friend. Oh, not more than friends? Unfortunately, this character is in a relationship with Morrigan, because I do think that is like my canon for it. Um, and Morgan does not like sharing, so I'll say no definitely Spoil not. Spoil sport. It is good to know what my options might be, but that is for another time. For now, we have much to do, yes? Oh, that was a big hit. I don't know. I don't what like say you? he takes disapproval for that. Uh, uh, I was just thinking about what happened to the elves, and I... 
I'm reminded of a song sung to me many years ago. It was when my mother died. And this wise elven woman comforted me and told me that we shouldn't fear death or hate it. Death is just another beginning. One day, we must all shed our earthly bodies to allow our spirits to fly free. That is comforting. It's a beautiful sentiment, I think. One that brings peace and hope to the grieving. I don't really want to listen to that. Sorry. Skill acquired. Oh. Uh. Something I can help with? Uh, nope. Oh, good. There you are. Wanted to talk to you. Mm-hmm. About? You and I, we've... You know how sometimes you spend time with people and things? Hmm. hmm. I love you too, Aubrey. Uh, yeah. What? <laughs> Keep your hands where I can see them. Uh, sheesh. Can a man address a friend without getting all weird? I was nope. just asking a favor. You had to go all that on me. A uh, favor? What is it? I was thinking, uh, I do know some people out here on the surface. Hmm. A person, actually. A girl I knew in Orzammar. Before I left, obviously. Uh, and you want to go find her? It'd be nice to talk to someone else who's been out here a while. Someone else from Orzammar. Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, and how do you her know? name's Felsi. She and I were uh, friends mm -hmm. after Bronca left for the deep roads. Ogre I'm sure she's forgiven me by now. Thought maybe I'd track her down. See how she's been Somewhat living. Somewhat misogynistic, if I recall. Uh... You know, I don't care if he cheated on her or if they were friends. That's none of my business. I tried to look her up the last time we were at Lake Kalanhod. She wasn't at work at the inn. At home with her sick mother, they said. I figured it was just the ancestors telling me something. But I keep thinking about her. Uh, we can go back. Well, and a good friend you are, Warden. I'll think about you if we ever... Uh, no, actually, that would be gross. No, uh, what was it you wanted to say? Uh, that was it, actually. Uh Why did he disapprove? That's annoying. Sen? You called. Nope. As you wish. Uh, Morgan. We're gonna go kill your mom soon. Like in two levels. Hmm, <laughs> I don't like that. Never mind. Uh, Got what it. Do the elves want crafting materials. I don't want to give you. I'll give you all the death fruit. We will make good use of what you have brought us, boy. <laughs> All right, so let's actually go deal with Ogren's old flame, uh, and then indeed, yes, we will. Uh, I'm gonna save. I realized my mistake. As soon as I hit, okay. Uh, da -da. You need more strength, Ogren, to get these abilities. Uh, so for now, uh, let's level you in the champion a bit. Um, I think you probably do need Master Archer. And then win. Increase your dex as well. I think I'm gonna be on a dexterity kick for a bit. Uh, let's 
get you to have life orb. And we'll come in here. Oh, I can turn in the Matus Collective stuff. That'll be good. Isn't that the point? The client is very pleased. Someone come back soon. Just players in a play. Uh, this is a power exactly. and determination. You. That's for a later. A later there she game. is. I'm gonna go talk to her. Look, you gotta back me up here. Got it? Uh, of course. <laughs> Thanks, Warden. Maybe I should talk to her first? Find out how much she misses old Ogren or who I have to kill, and then I'll go sweep her off her feet. That's me, <laughs> Mr. Charm. Um, I think this is... I'm gonna... What can I get for you? I'm gonna and this don't say mead. We ran out of that a week ago. And don't say rum, either. Ran out the day before yesterday. And don't say brandy. When did you run out of brandy? Oh, we haven't yet. It's just terrible. We got it from a shady Orlesian trader, and I think it might really be turpentine. Mm. Felsi! I need tables clean, girl! I've got a customer! Uh... Your name's Felsi? Aye. Who wants to know? I'm a friend of Ogren's. And you admit it? You don't smell drunk. Get kicked in the head by a Bronto, did you? Um... What happened between you two? What happened? Is that a serious question? Have you met Ogren? He got drunk. Drunker than usual, even. Took off his pants and challenged a roast nug to a wrestling match at my father's funeral. Oh, no. He lost, by the way. The roast no. got him in an arm lock. No. He sat there crying for half an hour before someone pulled it off him. How do you lose to a piece of meat? It was a sodding good roast. Felsi, what in Andraste's name are you doing? The tables, girl! Hey, chill out. All right! I've got to get back to work. All right, Arvin. Well, what did she say? Uh, she hasn't exactly forgiven you for the nug incident. Yeah, that fight was rigged. Anyway, the guard said it wasn't worth pressing charges, so she's no call to hold a grudge. Did she say anything else? Uh, not really. Go get her. Just be ready to pry her off when she throws herself at me. We don't want to make a scene here. Well, don't pry her off me too soon. I mean, a little scene's all right. Are you sure you're not a baker? Because you got a sodding nice set of buns. Well, look what the nug don't, dragged don't in. I should example, have known you were in the neighborhood, by the stench. What are you doing here? Uh, just trying to kick back with a pint. Fighting Darkspawn's a lot of sodding work, you know? You're fighting Darkspawn? Uh, yeah. It was a bit of pain, but it was a personal favor for the King of Orzammar, you understand? <laughs> A whole surface to choose from, and you just happen to come to my tavern? Eh, uh, well... Uh... Hmm... He was looking for you. You know, I was thinking about our days together back in Orzammar. <laughs> oh, so you mean you didn't find another girl willing to put up with you pissing on the table? I'm shocked. It's a sign of affection. You don't miss him even just a little bit? How can I miss him until he leaves? You keep saying that. I know you still want me, though. No it's now. like you can read my mind. Someone call the Chantry. This must be blood magic at work. I'm not gonna lie. He probably is more fun. If by fun, you mean more likely to light farts on fire? Yes. Oh, well, it's been fun. Don't let the door hit you in the arse on the way out. Oh, dang. Sorry, bud. That could have gone better. Probably. Um, there's plenty more where she... After this thing with the archdemon's over, I'll have to pry the ladies off with pliers, I suppose. <laughs> Might as well rest up while I can. You ready to go? Yep. Hi. Sorry, bud. Ooh, well. All right, all right. 
Uh, journal. There you go. That. I'm gonna save. Probably a good place to leave it for now. So thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate having you along. Treat yourself right because you deserve it. Deuces, gooses.